we want to find points of x where the second derivative of this will equal 0. So first thing we should do is take the second derivative. So let's take the first. So we have first derivative of x of the function of x. We can pull down the 10. And we have ax plus b to the 9th. Now we want times the derivative of this inside function, which is just a. So we have 10a times ax plus b to the 9th. Okay, now we're going to take the second derivative. Equals 10a. times 9 times ax plus b to the 8th, and again times a. So that's equal to 90a squared times ax plus b to the 8th. Right. So we want to find when this is equal to 0. The easiest way to set it equal to 0 and solve for x. So 90 and a squared, or a, are just constants. So let's divide both sides by that. We just end up with ax plus b to the eighth equals 0. So then if we take the eighth root of both sides, we end up with ax plus b equals 0. So now let's subtract b from both sides. We have ax equals negative b, and then divide everything by a. So here you can see that when x equals negative b over a, our second derivative will equal 0.